Good afternoon, everybody. Peter Ciccone, LongIslandZone.tv. I'm standing on Hempstead Turnpike in front of Zorn's of Bethpage. Food establishment has been here since 1940. Zorn Poultry Farm's been here since 1930. Ten years after they opened the poultry farm, they started, they opened the market. And as we were saying before, it does not get any more Long Island than Zorn's. If you've never had Zorn's fried chicken, you do not know what you're missing. So come on inside, we'll introduce you to the team, and you'll see how uh, the magic is made. We're here with Merrill Zorn, and to tell the story of Zorn's, you have to have Merrill Zorn <laughs> in the shot. Uh, Merrill, Zorn's is going on its ninth decade in business. Talk about the changes, talk about the things you've done, and then we always ask this, what did you do to survive COVID? Oh my goodness, that was a lot of tucking and rolling. Um, we just kind of went with whatever the rules were. Okay. And we were as careful as we could be, um, keeping social separation, you know, back of the house, less people in here. Um, masks, we always wear gloves, we're always we're over, over cleaning anyway, but you know, we just took it day by day. Now you, you literally grew up in this business and, and the family run business, the same families owned it nine decades now. What changes have, have you seen? How's the world changed? I mean, it's on the one hand a time machine where you see the old stuff that, that existed in the 40s and the 50s into the new building. What was the transition from one building to the new building like? That was hard. That was really hard. We went from 25,000 square feet to an 8,000 square foot footprint. Because okay. we had the basement, but it's just an 8,000 square foot footprint and moving over was was uh, interesting, but you know, I wanted to bring over everything I possibly could. My staff thought I was crazy, bringing doors and walls in, and uh, you know, bring. I brought everything I possibly could, even things that were on the, you know, that were part of the building. Um, is the eight thousand feet more efficient for you, though? It is. We still need a lot more room. We still have storage. You still have. Well, what restaurant doesn't have storage? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yes. We never had them before, but we do now. But it's you know, we we we're making it work. Okay, and then biggest change in uh, 90 years. Not, not that you've been around for all 90, but. <laughs> Close. <laughs> um, the biggest change. Hey, you know what's pretty funny? A lot hasn't changed. Okay. We still hand peel potatoes. We still make our own sausage. You know, the recipes are all the same. I think the thing that hasn't changed is, or well, the thing that has changed is we haven't changed. The really thing, a lot. The thing that hasn't changed is you guys haven't changed. And um, we were saying before, it doesn't get any more Long Island than Zorn's. So <laughs> thank, you. thank you for coming on a Long Island Zone. Uh -huh. And uh, yeah, like I said, uh, Zorn's was one of the ones we looked forward to doing. And thank can't you. tell the story of Zorn's without Merrill Zorn. <laughs> I so, appreciate that. Well, thank you. Well, you're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Love the opportunity. So that's the story of Zorn's going on nine decades in business in the same location. And with everything in the world that has changed, like Merrill Zorn said, not much for them has changed. They still make the sausage by hand the same way they always have. The recipes are still the same that the family's always had. So if you want some of the best fried chicken on Long Island, some of the best sausage you'll ever taste, come to Zorn's Hempstead Turnpike Bethpage and tell them you saw them on Long Island Zone. Thank you.